Hey everybody, how we doing today? Me and Rusty are out fishing today. Guys, it's beautiful. I'm finally caught up with all about the bait, Patreon, life stuff. <laughs> so I'm going fishing. So I figured something nice, quick and easy would be to grab a tarpon real fast. So that's what we're going to do. Well, hopefully, and try. <laughs> so that's the plan. All right, time to get rigging. I got the chum bag out so it's to track those pinfish. Got my bait rod there. Just got to switch over to uh, pinfish rig. I just had the bare 12 gold hook for catching ballyhoo. But I've got my little bait catching box there. So you're going to use a swivel, little egg sinker. I'll use the same 12 hook. And just a little tiny swivel. And we'll be ready to catch some bait. All right, we got our first pinfish, perfect size there. So the first one always goes right back out because you never know where the tarpon can be. There is tons of current out. So that'll help push that bait out where we need it to. And we'll just keep catching bait in the meantime, but at least we're tarpon fishing while we're waiting. I've caught a, quite a few this way, so I never know. And then we've got the D-Hooker 5000. Make it uh, pokey uh, free. All right, good to go there. I think we'll do about uh, six to eight. It depends on how many toothy critters. There we go. Come to me. Go. All right, just a couple more. What's going on? I got whacked on both of these setups. Still got something on this other one. Just trying to get this thing cleaned up. All right. Wow. That ripped that off. Let's see what we got on this one. Darkish, small tarpon, who really knows? Never jump, so thinking shark, but you never know. Oh, came off right there, whatever it was. Oh no, it's still on. <laughs> Had a sharkish tail, I think. It's weird that it did that. It was... Yeah, it's kicking like a shark. Thinking a nice lemon shark. It's not a nurse shark. I don't think. Seems like kind of big for a black tip. It didn't jump or run really hard. Oh, I broke it. Son of a beesh. Don't get to see what it was. Finally hit a tooth. Yeah, cut me off the hook. Oh, dang it. Uh, cooters, 
cooters, cooters. See if he'll stay on. Big boy cooters. Oh, this is where it cuts it. Get a bad angle. Given up. Fighting like a tarpon. Yeah, come on up. <laughs> Fast hands, fast hands. Uh, I want to pick you up. Uh, oh, 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 bad way to pick him up. There we go. Bang. Stink bomb. Big as a tarpon. Oh. There he goes. Bleah. All righty, we got Rusty all loaded up, ready to head on home. Uh, fortunately, there we got that uh, Hail Mary toothy tarpon. <laughs> at the last moment uh super happy to get that i just needed some sort of footage uh help me lead into the next half of the video which is uh my april patreon giveaway so uh, i'm gonna head on home and uh you guys can check that out all righty we are back so that concludes part one doing a little bit of fishing bend the rod thank god i caught that uh, big old stinky cuda it's kind of rough out there I uh, had just that little weather window. It's been windy the prior couple of days. Got things all turned up. Had that little dip in the wind. That's where I headed out there. And then right now it's rainy and stormy out there. So just super happy I got something at least. We'll get those tarpons when the winds clear up. But that brings us to part two, which is very, very, very good for me. Because that means after this video, I am finally caught up with everything. So after this, all I have to worry about is just fill orders and go fishing. Back to the good life. 
Uh, but uh, what I want to catch up today on is my All About the Bait product testers group for the month of April. That's right, April. I'm not three months behind. <laughs> I'm caught up to April after this video at least. But uh, for the month of April, the product testers product is this guy. A nice little lure organizer box here. So it's basically a two-sided hard shell case. There, got the rubber insert so you could uh, organize your uh, lures, hooks, flies, whatever there. Um, it's not quite fully submersible waterproof, but uh, it's definitely splash proof and it'll keep your stuff dry in that regards there. Nice little hard case. Uh, the way these things came about is actually, I've been using these for a while. Um, when I design a newer new line of baits, like for instance, it's lately just released the uh, Bucktails. Uh, the way it works is that I come up with the idea of a design that I want. Then I focus that to uh, my uh, designer, digitalizes it, sends it off to the manufacturer who basically builds me a sample. They send me a sample. I do revisions back to the designer, back to the manufacturer. And we just keep rotating it until I get the final product how I want it there. And the way we've been doing it is using these card cases to ship it all around since it's got to go all over the place and they make a great little uh, case for, for just that shipping purposes. So it kind of dawned on me that would be kind of good because I'm up to what I've got uh, three, 15 different yellowtail snapper jigs. I've got three different uh, Cobra jig heads. I've got six different uh, uh, bait fish jig heads. Now I've got uh, six, ten different bucktail jigs. So I've got a lot of stuff there, some custom stuff. So I figured why not have a way to organize all those for those people that are picking those all up. So I've got these. I'm going to be sending out to my April product testers. Um, I think for the All About the Bait, what I'll probably end up doing is some sort of sample pack that has like all-inclusive of all my jig heads and throw those in there, maybe some paddle tails or something, just like a sample of all my products, and then just throw in the case and ship it off that way. And I'll probably also have them available on the website uh, via if you buy a uh, pack of any jig heads, and I'll sell them, send them to you for like a five bucks. So nice little deal there. Don't check them out now. I haven't got it figured out yet. I got to design the website to make it work and all the freebie stuff, how it's going to work big pain in the butt so giving me a minute to get that figured out but in the meantime there's three different colors it's just the the insert it's got black light green and then a dark green options there but for my april product testers uh ten dollars to twenty dollars i picked out ten names and you should see them scrolling on one side or the other here so that's those plus my $20 and higher Patreon supporters uh, automatically will just get one. But remember, I'm behind February, March, and April for my $20 and higher uh, product testers group. So you will be getting not only the case, but you'll get a mask on each side. So two masks, face masks, plus a sample pack of all the uh, bucktail jigs. I think I've got the black and brown of the quarter rounds, and then either a uh, pink one or the chartreuse ones in the half ounce and the uh, three quarter ounce. So you'll get a sample box there with all those included in there. And that'll be for February, March, and April. I'm caught up. Plus, wait, there's more uh, for my new Patreon supporters. Sandy Harding, Lenny Walker, Brendan Hassan, Derek Bowser, Stephen Riccio, Brandon LaCroix, Frank Gallagher, Rob Cochran, Michael Young, Louis Delgado. Uh, I've got your stickers out in the mail, so you should be getting an envelope. Uh, I got February's sent out with the masks about a week and a half ago, so people should have gotten those for sure. Um, last week I sent out the bucktail jigs, and today we'll be going, well, actually Friday I already shipped out uh, the 10 cases to those people, and then 25 people, my $20 and higher group, have the full pack and they all went out Friday so you should be getting them anytime now this week 
But uh, there we go. I am caught up, super happy. Um, for those that don't know, the Patreon supporters, my product testers group, basically who they are is they're the ones that uh, take it to the next level. They don't just watch my videos, hit the subscribe button, the likes and all that. They go through, pop open their wallet, pull out some cash and make it rain, okay? And I take that money and I go out and uh, buy stuff and replace the things that are broken, corroded, get lost. Uh, buy new stuff that'll make the channel better or if I've got any left so I'm not uh, spending it on my vices hookers and coke and uh, investing it into new all about the bait products um, or just ordering more for resupplies because I'm getting wiped out because it's been like crazy busy so it really helps out all the way and I'm super appreciative to you guys so thank you very much if you're interested in doing that look in the description there's links there you can check that out and then I'll take you to the website so you can read about it but otherwise uh, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next video bye